All right, hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Today I'm gonna to show you guys how to render wireframe in 3ds Max 2000, 2018. Now, this is an issue that I had for a long time, for probably like uh, two months or so. And what I just done here is just a simple setup of a sword and what I modeled right here. And I'm gonna show you guys how to render this in wireframe because if I render it now in render production, I get just you know a clean but if you want to show this like how your geometry is put together and all that you're definitely gonna need this and I hope this helps you out so first off what you want to do is go down to your render setup and you want to change from scanline renderer to Arnold now Arnold is a new renderer in 3ds Max 2018 and if I render now nothing will show because nothing has Arnold material on here so what we're gonna do is we're gonna click on material editor or the hotkey M um, and what you want to do is really simple so let me let me just close everything off maps and probably this will close and Arnold so maps Arnold and then you'll get this go down to utility and from here you want to uh, pull this wireframe into the viewport now this is what you're gonna need um and the next thing that you're gonna need is a mat but let me just just quickly just hold down the end of this little button here drag it let go and then automatically this will appear click on material or just hover over it and go down to arnold and then go down to surface and click on mat and you get this and this is what you want to connect let me just make it a little bit smaller zoom out a bit and this is what you want to put here is just hold down the little uh, button here at the end and click and drag it over to your sword and just say replace it it doesn't matter and you can also put it on the floor as well otherwise this will not um, render the floor as well so and if you double click on the first map, map one, uh, there is a choice here with Polygon, but I think that the, that the glitch is still there. It doesn't really matter if you choose triangles or polygons. It's always rendering uh, triangles. Maybe they fixed it and we'll see. But if I, I wanna render polygon, it doesn't matter. Um, and let's just say that my line width is gonna be black and my line color is gonna be, gonna be gray. All right, now um, you can just click on render again, and there you go. Now it is still rendering in triangles, but it doesn't really matter. I mean, you can definitely see your wireframe and how it's set up together. And yeah, I hope the video was helpful. And I will definitely make sure that there are some more 3ds Max tutorials to come because I'm still uh, learning about the new setup of 3ds max 2018 and but yeah see you guys in the next video peace